Much awaited visit to India promises to infuse a new energy of common values of democracy, <coughs> internal diversity, and respect in 2016. After a phase of relative slow. We need further a common European policy on migration. Italy sa saved tens of thousands of lives at sea. The global phenomenon of migration sees us in the front line. On this, we need increasingly multilateral approaches. And we need to continue our efforts to disrupt the network of human trafficking open to the world. Masters of illusion are always at work, making sure that the legitimate causes for anger and frustration are exploited to the bone. And they are promoting protectionism. They are blaming trade and globalization. Against this, there is no silver bullet. However, with the creative wisdom of politics, we can ensure that policies which support growth go hand in hand with those that support social inclusion. Take off some of the points that you mentioned uh, during your address and ask if there are any concerns of strategic implications of the same. The international community has um, uh, two uh, relevant interests. One is uh, an where India can play a uh, decisive role. One is uh, fighting terrorism uh, and contributing to the international coalition against terrorism. We are trying to discuss and we are also trying to discuss with uh, Bashar al-Assad to find solutions. I am sure that at the end the real solution cannot be guaranteed by uh, such a leadership, but I am also sure that if we don't open a dialogue, a negotiation, a discussion, we will never reach our goal. And our goal is to restore the Syrian entity. Thank you.